every one of us would have experienced hiccups. Why does this happen? Let us see in today's video. Hi friends, I am Dr. Karamat. This is Scientific Doctor channel. In this channel, every week your queries are answered via short videos. If you want to see such videos, kindly subscribe to this channel. If you have any such queries, kindly post it in the comment section. I will try to answer them via short videos. Today's video is about hiccups. What is a hiccup? It is a repeated involuntary contraction of the diaphragm. The diaphragm is a muscle separating your chest from the abdomen. This is a muscle of respiration. So in each respiration, this diaphragm contracts and relaxes. Hiccups is an involuntary contraction. You are not voluntarily doing it. It happens involuntarily. And this is a repeated contraction. Not only there is contraction of diaphragm, but there is also contraction and closing of glottis. Sudden closing of glottis or the vocal cords. This leads to the peculiar sound which we call as hiccups. What is the reason for hiccups? Though the exact cause is not known, scientists have found how hiccups is formed. It is due to an irritation of the diaphragm or irritation of the center in the brain which controls the movement of this diaphragm. When does it happen? It can happen normally without any reason. It can happen if a person has a bloated stomach, if a person has consumed alcohol, if a person consumes hot or spicy liquids. So all these can produce irritation of the diaphragm and hence hiccups. Are they abnormal? No, absolutely not. Hiccups, simple hiccups usually resolve spontaneously in few hours or few minutes. When the hiccups don't resolve, especially over 2-3 to three days, we must visit the doctor to ascertain the cause. Sometimes it may be a simple cause like an acidity which with treatment gets better. Rarely, especially if hiccups present with neurological symptoms that is like headache, any difficulty in speech or movement, then this may indicate a problem in the brain. Hiccups is a totally normal issue. If it is persistent for more than 2-3 to three days, we need to see the doctor. Still with doctor, it may be a simple disease with, for which you can get simple treatment. Rarely, if you have persistent hiccups which are not responding to treatment, you may have to do specialized investigation and identify serious diseases. Friends, today we have learnt a little about hiccups. If you like this video, kindly share it among your friends and relatives. To see many more such videos, subscribe to this channel. Till we meet again. Bye.